So I saw Marvel Studios <coughs> Guardians of the Galaxy Holiday Special, which is a new special for Marvel when the Guardians will give Peter Quill a Christmas gift who is still grieving over the loss of Gomorrah. So here is the review which we actually see great <laughs> actors like Kevin Bacon is going to be here as well. Which the special actually begins with a cartoon where young Peter Quill, aka Star Lord, and Cracklin are actually celebrating Christmas. But Yondu, who is actually <coughs> surprised by Michael Waller, who don't like Christmas, which is the Scrooge of Marvel Universe. Which he actually do it all away, knowing of how he said that if ravagers want something, they can actually get it. In which we see how Cracklin actually is the one who told the story about how Yondu ruined Christmas for Peter, in which he's telling to Drax, Metis, and <clears throat> Nebula, I mean, Nebula, knowing of how he's actually helping everyone else, knowing of how Rocket is with Cosmos, and while the alien band sing the story of Christmas, which they actually say something about Santa having superpowers, which is actually a reference of the Newton actually named Santa Claus, which is actually from Earth 616, which is actually a mutant that actually based off the real story of Santa Claus, in which Drax and Mantis knew that Peter is still sad after Gomorrah died and while the Gomorrah from the year 2014 is still missing, they actually knew that they wanted to give Peter a perfect Christmas gift, but they actually knew that Mantis is Peter's sister, so they knew they actually wanted to give him a gift, which they actually heard the story of Kevin Bacon who actually portrays as himself, which the actor is preparing Christmas with his family. So they actually decided to go to Earth and actually grab Kevin Bacon as their Christmas gift to them, knowing of how they will actually present him as a gift. While they're actually sightseeing around LA, they actually realize that they have found a map to take them to Kevin's house. While they actually knew he doesn't want anything to do with him, well, this is actually his first MCU appearance since he's played Sebastian Shaw in the Fox Marvel movie X Men First Class knowing of how they approach him, but he's completely freaked out because they're actually aliens as they wrestle the police, given that Dave Batista was a former WWE superstar, they actually successfully captured Kevin Bacon, and they realized that the movies, which of course reference to Friday the 13th, Tremors, and Footloose, are all movies that he actually plays. And he is an actor, which Mance is using her powers to put Kevin in a trance, knowing of how he 
as presented to Peter when they actually decorated the village with Christmas decoration, which we see how heaven is still in the trends, which Peter is upset that he brought a human, which is human trafficking. As soon as Mentis got Kevin out of the trance, he's freaked out knowing of how he is actually still in shock that he's in an alien planet. Knowing of how Kraglin told him about how Peter saved the galaxy through dancing from his movie, which actually a reference of his ending of the movie when he got a stubborn family to actually give dancing a try and he actually defeated the villain of the first movie in which Kevin had decided to have a change of heart and telling the aliens the true meaning of Christmas through song in which Peter is happy that he has a Christmas gift which Mantis finally tells Peter that she is his sister which of course their father is Emu knowing of how he is happy that she, she told him her secret and of course we saw how Yondu opening the gift from Peter which is an alien doll, which he is actually happy in secret, in which the movie, I mean the special ends with a message written in the sky telling the viewers Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays, which at the post credit scene of Rocket and Cosmos dress up group, who actually have a giant body with still his small head, as a Christmas tree, which he doesn't get into the spirit of it, in which that is actually it. Now, I actually love this Christmas, I mean, this special from Marvel, which is a Christmas special, even though we're still in November, which December is right around the corner, and of course, we knew how everything is actually amazing. And also Kevin Bacon plays as himself, which we first seen him in his first Marvel role as Sebastian Shaw, the mutant who can absorb any attacks and reflect it back trace his heart, which this is still in the production of Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, which will release next year. So I cannot wait to see the third Guardians of the Galaxy movie coming out on 2023. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment or anything about the Marvel special. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr, and my Facebook page and Twitch. Until then, this is Anime Guys, we're here saying sign out. Laters, and be safe.